Now that we have covered using sensors to control Hummingbird outputs, let's try using a Hummingbird sensor to control scratch graphics. In this example, we will be using a distance sensor to change the size of the cat sprite character in the scratch interface. Go into your Hummingbird blocks and select a distance sensor. Make sure the port noted on your distance sensor block corresponds with where it is plugged in on your Hummingbird board. Next, go into your Looks tab and pull in a Set Size by Percentage block. This will directly affect the size of the cat sprite. Now go into your controls and select a forever loop. And after that, head into your operators and drag in a minus block. We need the minus block because we want to make bigger numbers when the object is closer. The distance sensor measures in a straight line, ranging from 5 cm to 100 cm. 100 meaning the sensor isn't detecting anything, and 5 meaning the object is as close as possible. If an object is closer than 5 cm, the sensor actually reads it as very far away, so avoid placing objects too close to the sensor. So for the values in the minus block, make the first one 105, and the second place the distance sensor block. Now take the minus block and place it in the set size by percentage block. Then take the whole thing and place it in the forever loop. Click the program to test it. Now when an object gets closer, the cat should grow in size, and when the object moves away, the cat should get smaller. Now let's make the sprite even bigger when an object appears near the distance sensor. Go to your operators and select a multiply block. From your original program, take the full minus block and place it in the second value of the multiply block. In the first value, we'll determine how much bigger we want the sprite to be. For this example, let's go three times bigger. Now take the completed multiply block and place everything back in the set size by percentage block. Click the program again to test it and the cat should have the same reaction as before, only on a larger scale. And that completes our example for mixing scratch graphics and hummingbird sensors. For more info, check out our other tutorials on YouTube.